The EcoFlow application from GE Healthcare can be downloaded from iTunes. Simply search for EcoFlow. The EcoFlow application simulator allows you to simulate various clinical scenarios, changing the fresh gas flows and the agent concentration to determine how EcoFlow can assist you in your clinical practice. Simply select Next. The first page allows you to get a basic outline of the simulator functionality. Let's begin with the EcoFlow Upper Tray application. This tray allows you to modify many patient as well as economic variables and allows you to determine how the display will work. With patient type, we can modify the weight of the patient. Language allows us to change the language on the display and associated with the EcoFlow variables. Currency allows you to modify the currency used to display the cost of the anesthetic. Colors allows you to select either ANSI or ISO standard color display. The minimum O2 marker allows you to change the EcoFlow oxygen minimum concentration. This will then be displayed on the EcoFlow fresh gas indication. And system allows you to select either the ASIS CS squared or the Avant CS squared. To minimize the upper tray, simply touch the display anywhere. Now let's display the EcoFlow flow tubes. Just touch the flow tubes. This changes from the standard flow meters to the EcoFlow display. The EcoFlow display has two primary pieces of information, the total flow on the left and agent consumption on the right. Let's start with total flow. The red bar at the top indicates the total flow of all fresh gases. The green fill up to the red bar indicates the percentage of the total flow, which is oxygen. The FiO2 guard allows you to display the minimum FiO2 required for this individual patient. On the right is agent consumption. The cost per hour is in the units you selected in the upper tray. Milliliters per hour of agent consumption are displayed in the bar graph, and the total number of milliliters consumed is displayed at the bottom. The numerics on the bottom left show you the oxygen total flow and the oxygen flow required to maintain the FiO2 selected on the display. Let's modify the oxygen concentration in the fresh gas display. Simply touch the O2 button in the lower left. We can now select a different oxygen concentration. We can now see that on the total flow of fresh gases, 50% is oxygen. The total flow is currently 6 liters per minute. Let's modify the total flow of gases. We'll reduce the total flow to 2 liters. We can now see how the EcoFlow display has changed. The red bar, set at 2 liters, indicates the total fresh gas flow. The green bar rises to 1 liter indicating the 50% FiO2 in the fresh gases. And our FiO2 flag shows us how low we can reduce the oxygen flow and still meet this patient's needs for a minimum of 25% oxygen in the inspired gases. Now let's introduce some anesthetic agent into the mix. Select the sevoflurane button on the ASIS CS squared and we can then increase the anesthetic agent concentration. We will introduce 2% SIVO. We're now flowing 2% SIVO. 
we can see that we're currently uh, consuming 13.5 milliliters of liquid sevoflurane per hour. This has a cost of $13.53 per hour. You can also see that the inspired and expired sevoflurane concentrations are rising and we have the associated MAC value for those concentrations. The EcoFlow simulator allows us to modify the display and understand the difference between the ACES CS squared and the Avant CS squared. Currently, we're utilizing the digital ACES CS squared system where anesthetic agent settings are made on the display. In switching to the Avant CS squared, the display will change, representing the difference between the ACES CS squared digital vaporizers and the Avant CS squared mechanical vaporizers. To switch to the Avant CS squared, select the upper tray. On the right, we'll see the system in use. Switch from ACES CS squared to Avant CS squared. Then return to the main display by touching the screen anywhere. You'll notice that the display of set anesthetic agent concentration down in the lower left has disappeared. Now, to select our new anesthetic agent concentration, select Gas Setup. You can then rotate the dial to introduce a new anesthetic agent concentration. To confirm the new setting, touch the display outside the window. We continue to display the inspired and expired agent concentrations, and to determine the vaporizer setting, press Gas Setup again. Here we can also modify the oxygen concentration and the total flow concentration. To return, touch the display. With the Avant CS squared, we get the same information about anesthetic agent consumption, as well as current fresh gas flows, the minimum O2 flow, and the FI flag. The EcoFlow simulator provides you with the capability to understand the impact of fresh gas flows and oxygen concentration within the fresh gas flows and the impact on your patient.